This tutorial will outline the proper setup and print preparation of a Mimaki CJV30 series printer and cutter. First, install a roll of media in the rear of the machine. Make sure to tighten and lock the media holders in place. Ensure the roll stopper arm is behind the roll stopper. This prevents the media from rolling out unnecessarily. Feed the media under the pinch rollers from behind and pull it out through the front. Ensure the placement of the media pinch rollers fall within the indicated markers. Slide the media clamps over the edges of the roll. Lower the pinch rollers as shown here. The machine will then ask how many pinch rollers are needed. In this case, we only require three pinch rollers. Adjust the settings accordingly. You can also adjust the pressure of the pinch rollers during both printing and cutting. Once selected, this is done automatically by the machine. While in print mode, press and hold the test print button to perform a test print. In this case, the nozzles are firing cleanly and printing can begin. Press the remote button. The printer must be in remote mode in order to send prints. In Rasterlink, go to File, Open, then select the file you wish to print. If you have more than one printer, make sure you have the correct machine selected. Double click on the imported file. Adjust the number of desired copies as shown here. You can also adjust the file spacing by changing the scan and feed inputs shown here. Once this is complete, select the Print Conditions tab. This is where you select the media type, print resolution, print direction, number of print passes, and other settings. Press OK once you are ready. Right click on the file and select Rip and Print to begin printing. For further assistance and information, visit allgraphicsupplies.com.